Let me go back okay. to your point, though, because it, you've meant, made it many times, which is barring Chinese companies from being able to raise capital in the United States. That would be a dramatic action. That would raise tensions uh, even up to a, a very high extent. And that might actually reverberate in the stock market in a way that none of these other geopolitical moves seem to. I agree with that. I think that that's the one that says, all right, our doors closed. Like we closed the door to the, to the Soviet Union. I mean, other than uh, Arm and Hammer going over there in the 20s to try to get the new economic policy out of Lenin, we basically stopped commerce. And this would be incredible to stop commerce by shutting down that IPO. And I have to tell you, I'm not, or, I'm not advocating to shut down the IPO, but I do believe that they will say something. I mean, they just, I believe there'll be a, an IPO tweet where Navarro will be on the tape and we will worry. And that will cause on July 27th the market to go down, which is the date that I'm using to say that this uh, short-term rally might be over. Thank you to uh, Larry Williams for giving me that one. He's a known chartist, David. And July, I know, July 27th. You know, yeah, July 27th peak. There you go. It, at, that's at the, two fifty nine p.m. That's interesting. No, no. Yeah, well, that's I've been using Larry Williams as the dean of te of technical. Everyone, you know, he's just a guy who's been around forever. The percentage R Williams, it, yep. it, he's a great technician, and he has called this rally nonstop. And he says, "Be careful, July twenty seventh. So, who am I to not say that all hell could break? No, no, that July twenty seventh could be a down day. It could be the start of." A little bit. We're yeah. getting over I mean, uh, we'll talk to Art Cashin later on this morning, who's been looking at seasonality toward the end of July. Generally not good. I noticed right. today Nat Alliance, Jim, says corporate selling, insider selling to buying five to one uh, wow. is the highest that we've seen. Only only two times this decade has that ratio been that high. Is, is that, and of course, is, insider that buyers Moderna? were. They, How much of that is Moderna? <laughs> they, they gave you a, a, a good tell back in March. Uh, no, the insider absolutely. buyers uh, called that right. That's just, uh, it's a bad stat. I mean, what can I say? We got some bad stats. We got uh, after July, the market's weak. Uh, we've got the, the possibility of a shot across the bow by shutting down a Chinese IPO. Um, and, and we've got, you know, this is in the pipe. Uh, so I'm, you know, just call me uh, a little more circumspect. I told the guys from my, uh, who run the charitable trust with me, let's find something to sell. I want something sold today.